Let's get over to our Jordan Bonke and Jordan this morning. It's a muddy mess, but the show must go on. The show must go on, you know, and I'm talking with the officials that are out here. They say that this is built for conditions like this. You talk about that lull right now, no rain. It's looking pretty good. And again, with each passing minute, the rain is going to be seeping into the ground. That doesn't mean it's not sloppy. And that's exactly what Dave was saying. Come, come on in, yep. Dave. Dave yeah. Folio with Scottsdale Fire. Thank you for waking up with yeah. us this morning. You just went and ch checked out the valet lot. We've yeah. got a car coming in from behind us over here. What are the conditions? What's your just assessment right now of some yeah, of the rain so, around? So, uh, the you know, this is a unified command system that we work in. Uh, the PGA, the uh, Pro Am security fire department. While we're slow, we're showing a really sloppy area. It's not like this all over the place. So uh, the course is one thing. the The PGA will handle that. The course is built for runoff. I sat with one of the grounds lead groundskeepers two days ago, where he talked about it's it, you know it handles rain. Out here, our biggest concern probably is just parking cars, which yeah. isn't really a fire concern. Right. Uh, PGA Epic Valets figuring that out. Um, it's got a solid base, but it's sloppy on t some parts. I just feel bad for probably the Parks and Recs guy, right? Because he's yeah. thinking in two or three weeks from yeah. now, he's going to put kids on this and play soccer, right? right? So uh, we don't want to ruin the parking lots. There are contingency plans in place, just like how we have contingency plans in place for the bird's nest, for instance. Sure. We have evacuation plans in every one of our tents set up. So we're ready to evacuate if we get lightning or if we get heavy torrential rains okay. or winds, right? right? Because so, but all these tents are super solid. There's over 500,000 square feet of tent that you can be under. Bring your umbrella. Yesterday, the crowds were still out. All of them had little $2 ponchos yeah. in their back that they pulled out and put on. So it's still going to be an epic event. People are still going to come out. It's not like this everywhere. Uh, the course is going to be great. And uh, yeah, so uh, the biggest thing is have a plan, right? So if they make a decision to change valet parking, follow the signs, people. Yeah, Please follow the signs. And there's alternatives, right? You can go park at Salt River Field, be bust in. Right. You can go park at Westworld, be bust in. So please take advantage of some of those. It might take the headache off of you of trying to get into some of these grass or parking lots. Still kind of a fluid situation. It Decisions is. will be made this morning on any yeah. possible changes. Yep. When do you think we'll have any idea on when that would be or what you can anticipate some of those changes? I would say again? follow social media, uh, watch the news. Yeah. The WM uh, will send out, uh, Waste Management will send out that messaging. We probably won't send it out. We'll probably yeah. just know about it report on it but uh, watch social media they'll make the the changes and big the biggest thing is please as you're coming into the venue if you don't have a lot a pass don't pull into lot a yeah. go to your where you're gonna park because you won't get in so and then once again if, if if they make a change with any of these lots the signage will be out on the street you'll see them on the street signs and then they'll they'll change some of those signage and then they'll change the flow of traffic right they'll get right. you to where you need to be Dave, thank you for the time. I'm going to come up a little bit. We're going to head back inside and see what the course looks like. I know you took Emmett Smith last year around the Princess, yeah. and now you just got to take this ABC 15 reporter, so I'm <laughs> sorry about that. But the, today is the Pro-Am. Lots of celebrities are going to be coming out, yeah. and it's right now looking okay. Better as the hours go on. We'll see what Mother Nature has in plan. But for now, Nick and Kaylee, leave the white boots at home. Yeah, and no heels. <laughs> no, no heels. That's part of the plan. No. Wear comfortable shoes so you don't slip out here. <laughs> leave the heels at home today, please. It just makes the people watching so much better, though, right? But yes, leave them at home. Dave and Jordan, thank you so much. We appreciate it. Thanks, guys.